Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will troubleshoot this issue. There was a problem resetting your PC and no changes were made. First of all, we will analyze why we are facing this issue. So there are mainly two reasons behind this error. The first one is Windows corrupted files. If your Windows file are corrupted, so you may get this issue as well. And the second is deletion of the important files from your Windows drive, okay? So first, we will repair our Windows files with the SFC command, okay? So go to CMD. Uh, right click on the command prompt and run it as administrator. Click on yes button when the prompt opens and hit this command SFC space slash scan now. SFC stands for system file checker which scans all the corruption inside your windows and repair automatically. So hit this command first and if you get any kind of error like uh, and if you get any kind of error like windows is unable to repair some of the corrupted files. So I will show you the another command to check that. So let's wait for the process to complete. It is now 48% and this might take 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, now the command is completed now and you can see did not find any integrity violation. Okay. In your case, if this command has repaired your Windows corrupted file, that you will see the message. And if not, you will also get the message like some files are unable to fix the error. So once the command is completed now, you need to exit out from here, okay, and restart your system. You need to restart your system and then again go to, once you restart your system, go to setting or go to search bar and reset this PC okay and try to reset this PC okay you can try and reset this PC and choose accordingly if your issue is fixed with the first system well and good if not then move to the second method go to CMD and run it as administrator again click on yes button when the prompt opens and this time we will re-enable first we will disable the recovery environment and then we will re-enable it what does the recovery environment it boosts the windows if something fails so it can also prevent your windows to reset okay the command is re isn't c space slash disable and hit enter Once you hit enter, operation completed successfully. And after that, V isn't C and then enable this. Okay. First disable it and then you can re-enable re it. You will get these command in my description box. After that, exit off from the command. Once these command are completed, restart your system and check if you are able to reset your PC or not. If still not, we can move to the advanced method. So we will go to the automatic options. Okay, that is also called recovery environment. So go to here start menu, click on here, setting, or you can hold shift key and then click on restart, but I will show you that. Or click on updates and security. Once you on that, click on recovery option here and click on advanced startup, restart your system. So I'm going to restart my system in a recovery mode and then we'll show you. Now we are accessing the advanced options. Click on troubleshoot. Click on advanced options. Click on command prompt.
put your admin password here. Now in this process, we will rename the software registry. Okay. So the first command is cd, cd space percentage win dir again percentage. You will get these command in my description box. So you can directly copy and paste and this slash again system32 slash config and hit enter. Okay. Now type ren space system again type system after space dot zero zero one and hit enter type ren software space software like this and dot zero zero one and hit enter once we hit enter you need to exit out from the command okay go to troubleshoot and click on reset your pc and then choose accordingly remove everything or keep your files okay if still not working we can go to the back go to advanced options and then click on startup repair this will repair all the corruption again okay so try this method again click on that and this is going to diagnose your pc and once it is done you need to have patience it will scan your pc as well as repair the files if you get this message startup could not repair your pc so this will not work on your pc if you still have problem and you are unable to reset your pc you can also restore your system if you have created so you can go to the back stage restore your windows in an old version or old days and try to reset your pc if these steps are not working on your windows it is recommended to reinstall the fresh window with a bootable pen drive so i will link a video how to make a bootable pen drive and install windows so hope this video is useful for you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching